Hey y'all, hey, how you doing? What up though? We're gonna call this one Jim Chronicles. Oh Lord, I'm taking the speed down. Maybe I need to take the speed down. So I'm out of breath when I'm recording this video. But I'm just sitting here. Actually, I'm not sitting here. I'm walking on the stair mask. Um, and the Lord was just ministering to me uh, about the promises, or better yet, about our heart's desires, right? So, whew, I might need to take this down a little bit more so I can talk to y'all real quick. So, um, as many of you know who've been watching my page or watch my videos or whatever, I used to belong to Lifetime Fitness gym and I have been at Lifetime since 2014 and um, I ended up canceling my membership at Lifetime last year April because it just kept going up in fees the prices kept going up and I was just like um, I just didn't find it to be beneficial because I had actually moved and it was quite a distance for me to get there so I didn't go as much as I used to but anyway um, Friday, well, let me back up. So, you know how you see people like people on my Facebook timeline or whatever, Facebook friends, people that I met at Lifetime and we're Facebook friends, or just people working out at Lifetime. And I'm like, dang, I show miss Lifetime. Like, Lifetime is a whole vibe. Like, it's, it is. It really is. It's just expensive. It can be expensive. So I was like, I should have kept my membership, right? That's what I was thinking. Because even though my membership was expensive, it wasn't as expensive as it is now. So I'll give you an example. When I started going to Lifetime in 2014, I think it was like $60 or something like that. $60 or $66, something like that. And over the years, you know, they increased it a dollar here, $2 there, every time your membership renews. And when I left, it was up to almost $81 a month, right? And I'm like, this is ridiculous. I'm about to pay $81 to come and I'm not even coming like that so I ended up switching to LA Fitness um, I got in LA Fitness with a great deal so it's like $25 a month right definitely not lifetime but I should tell myself you get what you pay for so it met the need that I had and it was good but it wasn't lifetime so Friday um, when I was working some of my co-workers were talking about this gym pass and I'm like, gym pass, what is that? And they're like, we got an email about gym pass. I was like, I never got no email about the gym pass. So I, one of the ladies sent this and I said, put me your email, right? And I don't know where I've been looking at this whole time. I hope I've been looking at y'all. Um, she said, put me your, for me the email. So she sent me the email. I clicked on it, opened it up, whatever. And I'm like, oh, this is cool, right? So for you all who don't know, I didn't know. Gym pass is something that my employer offers. And I think it's new. For us and my company is a new it's still a newer company they only been in business about five since 2018 is when they opened so almost five years and what it does you can pop, purchase different packages so like silver bronze gold that kind of thing and based on which package you purchase you can go to different gyms right so i'm like oh this is cool so i'm like can i go to lifetime and i could right so i was able to purchase the package and the package is $59, right? $59 a month. And it includes the lifetime and it includes the LA Fitness and then a bunch of other places I can go, right? I have a pass to use that gym. So they have some cycling classes, some like P45, which I think is like boxing or something. They just had different classes and different, um, different classes and different gyms in my area. I think like Crunch, I don't think, Planet Fitness was in there, but I'm not a Planet Fitness fan anyhow, but, um, so I signed up for a Friday and here I am, what's today, Monday? It's today Monday, right? Yes. Like, I don't even know, look, just started the weekend, I don't know what day it is. And here I am Monday, I just had to come in, they activated it for me, and I'm at the lifetime. So I just said all that to say, the Lord was ministering to me through that as I, as I was thinking about heart's desires and it wasn't a spoken desire that I had or something that I excuse me something that I said to the Lord 
it was just something that I would think about. Like, dang, I sure would like to get a lifetime, lifetime of old vibe. Like, the, the machines, the equipment, it's clean. You know, it's, I just really would have liked that. I was like, dang, I should have kept my membership. But the Lord provided me this opportunity. Here, another uh, Christmas present in the month of July. Clearing out the emails that keep coming through. Christmas present in the month of July that allowed me, or he gave me my heart's desire, right? So he just was ministering to me like, daughter, you see, I keep giving you these things, your heart's desire, things that you desire, for the things you didn't even ask me for. So I need you to trust me, continue to trust me in the big things, the things that you are seeking me for. And even though it hasn't come to pass yet, trust me, because I deliver, right? If as long as it aligns with my word and my will for your life and your heart's desire is typically the desires that God has put there as you continue to build a relationship with him and grow in that way, you will just see that your desires of your heart change. So I was like, wow, God. It was kind of the same thing, like, you know, I got my car, my, um, my new vehicle that is something that I desired. And I wouldn't even know if I desired it. It was just something that I liked, that I, I wanted, but it wasn't a big deal. Like, oh, I'm about to get this car, or, you know, when it's going to get this car or whatever. It was just a vehicle that I liked. And I was like, if I could get it, this is what I would get. I would get this year, I would get this color, da, da, da. And that's exactly what he delivered to me. It was my desire to be able to come back to Lifetime. And here I am, coming back to Lifetime way less cheaper because the new membership again is $130 easily. $130 a month for one person. And here I am paying $59 and I get to go to multiple gyms. Now my apartment community um, the, the, where I live has a gym and it's okay. But I just, it's something to me about being in the gym and it's just especially if you're in a gym with people who it's a whole different atmosphere right it's encouraging it's motivating um i lift weights so you know having that and then you kind of get to talk to people and you know it's just it's just different so god was just ministering to me so i'm here to minister to y'all what the lord ministered to me to trust him if he has continuously shown you that he would deliver that he has delivered check his track record that's what he said thank you Lord. he said check my track record have I not delivered on the things that you have sought me for? Um, so that's it, y'all. I just wanted to encourage you this Saturday. I'm gonna say this Sunday. Encourage you this Monday. Encourage myself. That's what the Lord did for me just now. To trust God. To keep your eyes on Him. Focus on Him and what He told you, and just enjoy life. And remain in expectation and remain with a grateful heart. I seen something this morning in the video I was watching on that. Um, it's all about God Farms, their YouTube page, the family who's farming. And the wife was sharing how her mother-in-law, um, her mother-in-law always wears a smile on her face. And I think she had a conversation with her about it early on. And she said that her mother-in-law told her, no matter what she's going through, she always tries to wear a smile on her face. Um, because whatever you're going through shouldn't affect that or whatever. So in order to pretty much have a smile on your face, you gotta have something to be grateful or thankful for. So that's my thing. As this machine says, five, five, five. I don't know who that's for, but it must be for somebody. Um, I wish I could show you. Can y'all see it? say five five oh it changed to five five seven i don't know if it was the five 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 on there or not but Whew. okay that's it i just wanted to share that with y'all the lord says check his track records he delivers on his promises um i'll talk to y'all later bye